Hello, my name is Tom Cannon. I am a member of the Oshkosh writing community. I'm the inaugural poet lawyer of Oshkosh. And uh, I am also the one of the hosts of a show called The Author Showcase. I co-host it with uh, Dixie Jarko. And I just wanted to pull a couple books off the shelf from Oshkosh or Wisconsin writers and talk about them briefly. Okay, so my first book, let's try it look over here and grab one. Let's grab a couple. I have some books by uh, Juliet Rossetti. Juliet Rossetti is a Oshkosh writer. And I have quite a few of her books on my bookshelf. She has, also has a bunch of books on Amazon. Um, some that have done very, very well. Uh, here we have a book, You Are Not Who You Say You Are. This is a quite the surprising book, well written, about um, a sort of uh, post-apocalyptic, but not really, uh, book about a young teen who um, gets on the run and... Uh, it's kind of love interest, but also has some elements of uh, uh, fantasy. It's been a while since I read it, the, what the main character turns out to be. It's a mythical creature, um, but it's just great. Very suspenseful, uh, high stakes, uh, just very well written. And then she has a re book of Return to Sender. Return to Sender is this about this... Real, very realistic, very real uh, situation where little kids were mailed through the U.S. Post Office and their main character uh, is a feisty young girl. She's just very, and she gets shipped off to her aunt in Appleton, her aunt in Appleton, and um, she, the aunt and the uncle turn out to be very bad people. Uh, and uh, she, the main character, is with her son, her, I'm sorry, her bro little brother, Maddie, who's just very little. Um, so she has to protect him. It's very well done, very realistic about what it would be like to <clears throat> have a little, to be responsible for a little, for a little toddler, basically. It's, uh, yeah, very well written. And, it, and uh, it'll keep you turning the pages. I also have one of her books, Night of the Burning Tents. It's about the um, Ludlow Massacre, uh, where uh, the union was busted for the, the mining union. And they, um, they're in the Great Coalfield Strike. But again, it's also kind of young adults, about a young, a very young girl, not very um, who uh, becomes responsible, has to become a breadwinner and uh, pretend, first pretend she, she's a boy, and then they go on strike, and uh, she and her family have to survive during very um, cold winter, when there's violence and, uh, you know, union busting. I also I recommend all of Juliet Rossetti's books. Her writing is uh, just uh, very well written. It's uh, beautiful language without going overboard. Uh, so I invite you to read her books. Okay, I have here a book that I pulled off of my bookshelf. It's by an Oshkosh writer. It's Jess Riley, Driving Sideways. This came out a long, quite a few years ago and uh, I've kept it. I really like this book. I'm just gonna read a little bit about it. Leah Fielding Wants a Life. Seriously, having spent the past five years of her dialysis, she wants a simple wish to make it to her 30th birthday. So she goes on this uh, trip 